my <clears throat> dark chocolate peau de cremes. Oh, these are so good and rich and creamy. All I need is heavy cream, dark chocolate, sugar, egg yolks, and cherry jam. Start with a cup and a half of heavy cream. I just wanna get this in this pot right here. And I want a quarter cup of sugar. So I wanna get this on, bringing it just below a boil where you start to see those little bubbles around the edge and then turning it off, then it's done. Then basically you're dissolving the sugar at the same time. This is what's gonna melt our chocolate. So I just wanna give this a nice little chop. And this is gonna help our chocolate melt nice and easy. We're just gonna pour our hot cream right on top of this. A little bit right on top and it immediately starts to melt the chocolate. Right, now I'm gonna set this aside and let it continue to melt just a little bit more and I want two egg yolks. Now the trick when you're cracking your eggs, just go right down on a flat surface and you'll always get a nice even crack that way. Great, now I've got my egg yolks and I wanna temper now my egg yolks. So what I wanna do is take a little bit of this hot mixture, so I can do this with my left hand, and ladle it in as I'm moving those egg yolks around and I'm bringing the egg yolk temperature up to the temperature of this hot cream and chocolate. And that's all tempering is. So just put all of that mixture right back in. And all I gotta do now is put them in my ramekins. This is so easy. Gently put these in this pan that I'm gonna bake them in. So I'm just filling this with hot water and that's bringing up the temperature of these pot de cremes. And then they're not gonna shock in the oven. Just put these in the oven. Quickly get your door shut because it's 350 degrees and we wanna leave it there. We're gonna bake them for 30 minutes. When you pull them out of the oven, they're still gonna be jiggling just slightly, but you wanna let them sit until they come up to room temperature. Dark chocolate pot de cremes with cherry whip topping. And that's what we're making right now, the cherry whip, so fast and easy. I've got half a cup of cream that I've been whisking and I need to add a little bit of sugar. Now the trick is, slowly add it in. It'll help it dissolve, help it get in there. Just, that's exactly what I want. Now, to make it cherry, I have cherry preserves, and I want a quarter cup, to be about two of these guys. Look how gorgeous this looks. Perfect, so I just wanted to loosen that up, and now I just wanna fold in some of my cream. I'm gonna take some of this and you just wanna put it in right on top of those cherry preserves. Now watch this. Oh yeah. That is so gorgeous. Now it's time to garnish the pot de creme. Gorgeous, now I just want a clean spoon, got one right here for the money bite. Now I know you want a bite, I know you do, but it's for me, you'll have to make it at home.